I'm John Walker, President-elect of the Virginia Bar Association. And in keeping with tradition, thank you. In keeping with tradition, I will begin the banquet program with a toast to our president, Tom Bagby of Roanoke. Here's to the extraordinary job that Tom Bagby has done as president of the VBA this past year, a year in which he has taken the association's communications to unprecedented excellence, a year in which he has put the VBA at the forefront of leadership on the critical need to fill the numerous judicial vacancies in Virginia, a year in which he has worked diligently uh, to make the VBA more inclusive and more diverse, and a year in which he has served as an outstanding ambassador for the VBA uh, at numerous events throughout the state and across the country. All along the way, Tom has represented the association with the character, integrity, and thoughtfulness for which he is well known and widely respected and the association has benefited tremendously from his exemplary leadership. Please join me in raising a glass in honor of Tom Bagby and congratulate him on a job well done. Hear, hear. Thank you very much. At this time, I'm gonna turn the podium over to Vincereta Childs, the president of the Old Dominion Bar Association. Good evening. I, of course, bring uh, greetings and salutations on behalf of my board, um, but I am especially uh, pleased to be greeting you personally. I met Tom and his wife Kathleen actually when he was the president-elect of the Virginia Bar Association. Um, he immediately um, embraced me, embraced my organization, and for whatever reason, decided that um, his tenure with the Virginia Bar Association was going to involve um, a, an agenda that included, included reaching out, um, inclusiveness, and he wanted my bar to be key to that. When he... As he continued and actually became the president, um, I began to wonder and to think that um, the founders of our organization um, started the Old Dominion Bar Association because we were not included, um, because we were not involved, and because we were not at the table. Tom's efforts and sincere and genuine um, sincerity in reaching out to me, my bar, and our organization was so tremendous uh, that I was just immediately humbled and thought about Oliver Hill and Sam Tucker and those who started the Old Dominion Bar Association to get us to a point where a Tom Bagby would say, we need to have you all at the table. So on behalf of my bar, uh, my board, the members of our bar association, we recognize your efforts, Tom. We appreciate your commitment and we salute your vision. Cheers. And just one final thought, um, during the course of our tenure as presidents of VARS, uh, Tom and I and Kathleen and I attended a lot of VAR meetings. <laughs> <laughs> and um, we really got to know each other professionally and personally, and Kathleen was such a treat to meet. Um, and during the course of that, um, Kathleen mentioned to me that um, Tom was not a dancer and that we, 
And she said, Vincerella, he never dances. I don't know what's up with him, but you know. So we would be at Virginia State Bar. We would be at Virginia Trial Lord. I mean, we just all these magnificent events and there would be bands playing and they would be standing to the side. She said, he doesn't dance, Vincerella. So I'm just like, okay. So um, it, just occur it just happened that on one event, she got him on the dance floor and I just happened to have my camera. <laughs> Kathleen, if Tom ever tells you he doesn't dance, you know he does. <laughs> I recorded it, I got it on my camera and I blew it up and you put it on your wall and you don't take that from him anymore. <laughs> Thank you so much, John and Vincereta. Coming from the two of you, it's particularly nice to hear all those kind words. Uh, undeserved, but still very kind, but I appreciate it. And I do dance once a millennium, and I've already done it, so <laughs> don't have to worry about it any longer. 